I'm Ray Isle. I'm the executive wine editor for Food and Wine magazine, and this this is the American wine that was poured at the royal wedding um, recently. It's we're the first ones to be able to tell you what that wine was, which is pretty darn exciting. It is the Domaine Eden Pinot Noir. Nobody has this information. This is this is you know top secret breaking news. I'm going to tell you exactly what I think of the California Pinot Noir that was poured at the royal wedding. Um, I'm actually pretty confident because um, Domain Eden is the second label from a winery called Mount Eden, which is actually one of the greatest Pinot Noir producers in California. So, Megan, odds are you have really great taste. Um, of course, but does Megan care what I think? Who knows? She's busy being a princess. Actually, she's being the Duchess of Sussex, I believe. And he is now the Duke of Sussex. So, um, let's go here. That's Pinot Noir is what that smells like. That's beautiful kind of raspberry scent. Oh. Crisp, light, a lot of flavor though. A little bit of spice, got a little pepperiness on the end. A little bit of kind of tea leaf character. A very appropriate English tea leaves. And that's actually a lovely bottle of Pinot Noir. That's the 2014, which was apparently what was poured at the wedding. Um, they went through nine cases of it. It was the only American wine poured at the wedding. Again, Domain Eden Pinot Noir 2014. And apparently because they drank so much of it at the royal wedding, there's not that much left. However, the 2015, which is coming out quite soon or may even be out now, um, I'm gonna taste it as well and tell you if it's remotely up to par with the royal wedding wine. The cork is similarly constructed. It's made out of bark just like a cork always is. 2015 of Domain Eden. Uh, this will not be used in a royal wedding because they're not gonna have another one next year, one assumes. This is terrific too. This is actually, I might even like the 2015 a little better than 2014. See, that's, um, they're both lovely wines. 2014 has just a touch more age, as appropriate, it's a year older. Get a little more of that tea leaf character. 2015 has a beautiful brightness. It's um, it's very fresh raspberry, kind of almost like we get that crunch of the raspberry when they're really, you know, when the skin is really taut. Um, that's a lovely wine. Um, again, these, you know, these wines are about 40 bucks a bottle. Um, Mount Eden, their top wine, Mount Eden Pinot Noir is about 65. It's a beautiful wine that ages forever. Um, I'm impressed. Meghan Markle, good choice. And you know, representing the U.S. at the royal wedding in England, um, the next step is we just take over because you know they once ruled us, and now it's time for us to go back and and uh, rule them, right? Um, maybe not. Who knows? Um, in any case, here, cheers to the royal wedding. Cheers to the happy couple. Let's all drink some Pinot Noir. <laughs>